people often refer to forensics as dealing with dead people. Forensics in this case is dealing with the detail, researching, being the detective, finding out all the information. It's like a crime scene. Let's find out all the information. Let's find out what occurred so that they can catch the perpetrator. So forensics is just about detail and making sense of what happened. People ask me, where does the name Forensic Healing from? How did it come about? Well, it would come about when I would be doing healings on people and then I would relay this information back to my husband. And they'd get really excited and I'd go, well, I found this and this occurred and really interesting information would come up. And when I'd find the information or find the cause, then the healing would begin. And I remember him texting me and he said, you're a forensic healer. And I thought, yeah, forensic healer. And I've come to realize that's exactly what forensic healing is. It's identifying the cause, finding the root cause of why someone has what they have. And when you do that, it will release. It's like when you find the age of when something happened and then what happened and get all that information. It started to it starts to expose the cause and then it starts to get released. Other therapists do the very same, like a chiropractor, he will identify which vertebrae needs to be adjusted for the body to be aligned. A blood analysis will look at blood and look at what parasite or what virus or bacteria is in the blood that needs to be removed for that person to be healthy. So there's many ways that a therapist will identify exactly what the cause will be in, in, in their type of therapy. And when they identify it, then the healing can begin. They, they know exactly which area of the body to target. A forensic healer applies energy for it to be released. And then when it's released, the body can innately heal itself. Because when the body has these stresses piled upon them, it, it goes in stress mode, it goes in disease mode. So releasing and taking off the layers lightens the body and it becomes more healthy and more balanced. When someone comes to me with a condition, what I look for is when it occurred, like was there a trauma in the body? Was there toxicity happening? What, when did this occur? So I find the age, I find that information. Then I find what occurred. So who was it? What are the details and how it occurred? And I start to get the bit of the story and the information. And that's what I'll do when someone comes to me, finding out the who, what, when and why something occurred. And then in that, healing can happen, release can happen, and that's when the beginning of the transformation happens.